Russian Embassy in Jakarta celebrated its National Day on the 17th of June at the Red Carlton Hotel Jakarta. During the event, the Russian government awarded numerous medals to Indonesians who helped the search and rescue efforts for Air Asia Flight QZ8501. As the world's largest nation, bordering European and Asian countries, as well as the Pacific and Arctic Oceans, Russia is a silent giant whose presence might be a little too far removed to be felt by everyday Indonesians. Its cultural richness is another vast subject to cover. It is famous for the novelists such as Tolstoy and the Tovsky, plus the Bolshoi and Marinsky Ballet Companies. St. Petersburg, founded by legendary Russian leader Peter the Great, features Baroque Winter Palace, now housing part of the Hermitage Museum's art collection. Luckily enough, Jakarta got a glimpse of Russia's many wonders during Russia Day or the Day of Adoption of State Sovereignty of the Russian Federation, which falls on June 12th. On June 17th, the Russian Embassy for Indonesia held a reception at Ritz-Carlton Hotel Kuningan, South Jakarta, to celebrate the national holiday that has been celebrated ever since 1992. However, the event did not only honor the spirit of Russian nationalism, it also celebrated the harmonious bilateral relationship between Indonesia and Russia, particularly in Indonesia and Russia military cooperation. The night especially highlighted the partnership between the two countries during the search of the ill-fated Air Asia flight QZ-8501. Throughout the search efforts in January 2015, Russia's search and rescue team arrived with the BE-200 amphibious aircraft and the 276, a heavy transport aircraft, as well as more than 70 rescuers. Russian SAR personnel were previously involved in the search of a Russian-made Sukhoi Superjet 100 that crashed into Mount Salak Bogor, West Java in 2012. Several Indonesians who helped during the search for Air Asia Flight QZ-8501 received the America Medal of Russia Participant of Emergency Humanitarian Operations from Russia's Ministry of Emergency Situation. Hubungan sangat baik sejak 65 tahun yang lalu ya. Makin hari harus bertambah erat ya, tidak boleh longgar ya. ya. Saling memberi begitu. Kita juga beli alat sista banyak dari sana. Indonesia and Russia has been great friends for decades ever since Indonesia's independence. In fact, Russia was one of the first states to recognize Indonesia's independence. Russia and Indonesia have respected each other's international obligation and sovereignty. Russia, just like Indonesia, respects the notion of non-interference in state sovereignty in the sphere of international relations, economy and defense. Clear example of uh, this growing partnership between our countries was exactly the joint participation in search and rescue operation after this tragic, uh, uh, tragic incident after this crash of Air Asia. Uh, that is why Russian Ministry of Emergency Response and Russian government decided to decorate uh, these uh, Indonesian colleagues. Uh, and first of all, Pak Bambang Sulistio, the chief of Basaglas, Pank Tatank Kurniadi, chief of agency of air transportation safety uh, with uh, medals of Russian Emergency Response Ministry. It is our uh, appreciation, it's uh, the sign of our appreciation of this pr uh, brilliant professional activity of our colleagues. One of the highlights during the event was awarding of medals to members of Indonesian search and rescue team which ended successfully. Uh, terima kasih. Uh, saya sebenarnya sangat bangga sekali ya dapat uh, ini uh, penghargaan ini medali ini dari perusahaan dari negara Rusia. Yes, of course, uh, our cooperation are much broader than defense, though defense uh, is a very very important part of uh, our cooperation and uh, I am very pleased that uh, His Excellency Mr. Remizar Traku, the Minister of Defense of Indonesia, uh, has underscored in his speech today uh, the importance of our defense cooperation too. Every year uh, the Russian government uh, provides uh, about 100, 100 scholarships for Indonesian students to study in Russia. So.